I, I certainly don't need any time to uh, decide how I would vote on this issue. Um, House Bill 5485 uh, provides that in the case of fire department issues, an arbitration decision shall be limited to wages, hours, conditions of employment, including minimum manning. <clears throat> this legislation, as was stated, passed by the House. While we're hearing there's all kinds of opposition, it did pass in the House, the General Assembly, 66 to 44 on Monday. And I'm going to suggest that it's very likely that it's going to pass the Senate as well. This legislation doesn't do anything to the village of Oak Lawn. We are already subject to an appellate court ruling that ruled against us on the minimum manning issue. The appellate court determined that the village had, had engaged in an unfair labor practice by refusing to bargain with the firefighters on minimum manning. I have a copy of the opinion here with me right now if anybody wants to read it. The court's determination affirmed the Illinois Labor Relations Board's decision. We've been living with that reality in Oak Lawn, uh, the reality of minimum manning as a mandatory subject of collective bargaining since 2011. We followed the advice of the village manager and we lost the arbitration hearing. We also lost the appeal. The Labor Board ruled against us. The Appellate Court ruled against us. The Supreme Court won't take the case. Minimum manning is now a mandatory subject of bargaining in Oak Lawn. So we're taking a stand that it may have an effect on other municipalities, but it will not benefit Oak Lawn in any way. We are subject to minimum manning, whether the bill is passed into law or not. We have spent hundreds of thousands of dollars fighting the unfair labor practice charges and appealing losses. Now we're asked to pass a resolution that opposes a law that doesn't really apply to us. The taxpayers are flat out of patience and we are flat out of money to spend to defend ourselves against useless lawsuits. My question for you, Mayor Barry, is what are you trying to accomplish with this resolution for the people of Oak Lawn? Thank you, uh, Trustee Strait. Um, that is an excellent question. What I want to do is make sure what's going on in Oak Lawn doesn't reverberate beyond that. As a mayor, I communicate with, I, I have a more regional approach perhaps than your microcosm in District 3. I'm aware of how much